Hey guys, welcome to Stability Before Strength. My name is Oscar and I'll be your guide through this 13 week training plan. This is week three, day seven, and this workout burns between 1,366 to 1,437 calories. Today is day seven, so you can skip the warm up and increase the cooldown routine since we're gonna go for a long, slow distance run. During these LSD runs, you wanna make sure to run at a slow but steady pace for 90 minutes or 25% of your weekly total mileage, whichever takes the least amount of time to complete. For example, if you run 40 miles a week, 25% of 40 is 10, your long run should be 10 miles or 90 minutes, whichever takes the least amount of time to complete. These long runs play a very important role in our training program because they help create specific adaptations that can only be generated by long, slow distance runs. This workout burns a lot of calories, most of them coming from your fat storage. So this is one of the best workouts to do if you want to lose undesir undesired fat in your body. If you don't have enough time to do an LSD run, you can always break the run up into a morning and evening run. For example, if you're running 10 miles for your LSD run, then you can simply run 5 miles or 45 minutes in the morning, then do another 5 miles or 45 minutes later in the evening, just as long as you get 10 miles or 90 minutes of running in. The LSD is the most important run for phase 1, which is why there's no part 3 for today. In phase 1, there is no exercise workout for day 3, day 6, and day 7. Use this time to rest and recover or perform more stretches to help keep your body healthy and injury free. Concentrate on areas that you feel need improvement. You can use the running stretches found in the cooldown routine and increase the amount of time spent on each stretch to 30 to 60 seconds or perform each stretch 3 to 4 times. Here's the list of all the stretches that are included in this routine. You can click on the link to guide you through all the stretches. That's it for today. Remember that this is phase 1 and that each phase lasts 3 weeks for a total of 13 weeks before the half marathon. Thanks for watching, I hope this video was helpful and informative. See you guys later!